What up, what up, everybody? Welcome back to Mohi TV, man. We got some whole shit to talk about, man. If you think I'm here to play around with y'all, y'all damn on now. Man, today I got a real, real special guest to me, man. Introduce yourself to the people, man. Man, it's Controversial Real, a.k.a. Faux Real in the building, 290. You know how we rock, bro. Shout out to 290, man. We gonna get right into it, man. Up, so, man. for real, for real, we had some real stuff going on right here in Memphis. We, we had about five, uh, what, about five or six officers involved in the killing of a young black man, Tyree Nicholas. Man, Tyree Nichols, man. Hey, Tyree right. Nichols. Explain yeah, to the man, people what happened, man. Five black officers, man. Black at that, folks. Five black officers. Mm -hmm. He resisted the rest. He did run. You know what I'm saying? They chased him down, beat him up. My man's died three days later, man. Shit crazy, man. They sold out. Yeah. Now you would think our people would be protecting us, folks. So you know it was a little backstory. They said it was basically uh, one of the officers, uh, Tyree, was trying to talk to his girlfriend, basically. Yeah, yeah. At FedEx, yeah, he reacted to it. Yeah. yeah, yeah. They tried to say uh, they had a relationship at FedEx and shit. You know what I'm saying? Right. Confronted Nichols. Damn, I didn't do anything. Hey, I didn't turn your ass around. All right, all right, all right, all right. Hold the ground, hold the ground, hold the ground. All right, all right, all right. 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 Okay, oh, now, stop. I'm chasing him. All right, okay. All right, all right. Break your shit. Okay, okay. dude, damn. Turn the fuck around. Put your fucking hands on your back. Bitch, put your hands on your back. Quick. Okay, stop. I'm going to knock right. your ass the fuck okay. out. Okay, you guys are really doing a lot right now. Bro, stop. lay down. I'm Wait. just trying to go home. Lay down. Man, if you don't lay down. Oh, I am on the ground. Put your hands on your stomach. I'm afraid. I'm afraid. I got you. Okay. Get the fuck back. Stop. I'm not doing anything. Yeah, yeah, you see the video, you know what I'm saying? And the world sees a video of your child, and these is black officers, folks. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Me personally, I was actually on road to be a cop. I took police exams and all that. I passed all that shit. But I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it for the simple fact that I care enough about black people that I couldn't turn on Speak my people. that shit. I couldn't turn on my people. But do you feel like you turn on your people? Because police are like supposed to help people. They they do, but this is the thing, motherfuckers. Because who you call in that fight was going on? Well, the lady upstairs called the fire department for she she. Oh my god! It was, it's a white lady upstairs, y'all. She. Oh my god! Let's, let's not say we don't need them. I could. No, I'm not saying we don't need them. Let's not say they ain't for us. But all we, we definitely need to meet, especially when predominantly black communities. For you need community policing. For you need black people who out there legal registered to do this shit. Because me personally. How you doing? Who pump your gas? Huh? Okay, new area. Okay. Do you know who pump your gas? Okay. You know who your gas tonight? You hear me? Oh, you know that. All right. Thank you. Hey, okay. That's what's up. Thank y'all. Police. Like it's not confirmed, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's, it's not confirmed. Demetrius Haley or some shit. Yeah, that's his yeah, name, yeah, Demetrius yeah, Haley. Yeah. yeah. It's not confirmed that he was, you know, went on that rant. Uh, yeah, that was definitely a rant. Yeah. Went on that damn spell about his girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, people ain't playing about that girl. We get that. But hey, it's like. They say baby mama. Yeah, but it's like, if, if she doing that, why you crashing out? She already done. And, and it's bad because, because as, a, as a cop, them niggas be feeling so empowered. Like, mm -hmm. nigga, my baby mama. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, you a lame ass nigga. Like, my baby mama. If you was a regular nigga, you wouldn't act like this. Yeah. But since you a cop, 
And he's all black. You ain't finna do that to mine. Yeah, yeah. For, hey, I know this nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit crazy. But the bad part about it is, what motherfuckers gotta realize, they just showed you how much you really still a nigga. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. When the white cops kill motherfuckers, before they killed Tamir Rice, he was 12. You know how long it took them to get charges and all that before they dropped y'all last night. Right like that. away. And look though, the uh it was a Caucasian officer involved. Facts. And he only got suspended with like like leading, pending, you know. Pending investigation. Yeah, all you of them in custody. And he came last. All of you them are me? in custody. If you we might the video, and then, you know what they like to put in the video just to make it kind of seem like they're not being biased or favoritism? Yeah. We don't know his uh involvement yet. Bro. Motherfuckers explained to me the white officer was the first one to tase him. So my thing is like, why y'all put see, him I last? Know. I just saw I just saw online that they didn't know his involvement. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. They didn't know he had you know going on with it. So my thing is like how they protect the white officers, mm -hmm. they're quick to disassociate themselves from the black officers quickly. You feel me? They yeah. they never brought nobody up that fast. No, you, know you, you can go back to these Chicago cases with Laquan McDonald and uh, George that, Floyd. That was crazy. Oh, that was crazy. They wasn't George, getting, George they wasn't, Floyd took some time. They fucked shit up before they brought him. That's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Now I don't know. Now we don't how much time now, is you, between now, here, now, how we now how we saying this? Yeah. This this they point. We're trying to do better. The, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're that's trying like, to do better. That's like but you gonna make an example out of the black officers. Out of the black officers. That's a fact. You thought you was in this brotherhood. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? We'll yeah. show you quick that hey. He done robbed back? Hey, get them the fuck out of here. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Quickly, for that shit crazy. I, 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 I don't understand how they would ever join that side, but you know. The yeah, you know they got that uh, new movie uh, out with uh, Joe and Hill and Eddie Murphy, Lauren London. What is it called? Uh, 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 you, 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 you people? You people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah I, I watched it. I watched it. You like it? Yeah. I watched it too. It was decent as hell. Um, I think they tried it was, it was too settled. hard to make Lauren London look black. I, I ain't like that. Yeah. Uh, I, I, I fuck with it. Yeah. yeah it, 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 I it, mean, it, but yeah. what if that's her though? Because we don't know her. We don't know her. Um, I think black women wear regular shit. She was just like always so <laughs> bright and colorful, bass earrings, little bit. Like, don't stereotype me. No, I don't. You know I mean, women who dress like that. I do though. You know what I'm saying? And then, like, they had. Deep in their roots. They had moments where, like, she was just spazzing on them for nothing, for Like, she was mm -hmm. tweaking. I'm like, folks, don't paint our women, even though we know we gonna do it. Don't put it out there to the world. <laughs> you feel yeah. me? But like, uh -huh. we go through it, we might be this motherfucking chilling. She's spazzy. You like, damn, is you good? You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, oh, you said don't let the world yeah, know. Yeah, don't let the world know. Don't portray our women like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But I, I mean, we go through it. Mean, that's just shit I mean, we gotta go. Through. How real you want it to be real? You want, I, the, you want the movie I, to be real? He gotta be real. Me personally, I ain't they gotta be real shit. So I, I get that, right? Yeah. But at the same time, I just want them to portray us in a better light. Don't give us the bullshit. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Because you gonna give us angry. Black I feel no. Nah, I feel like that was a good movie though. It was. It, I, I feel like. I feel like. Don't don't. You taking that part of the angry black women? But I'm gonna say. Think about the part when Eddie Murphy was explaining the history to him. Fact. The part when they was telling them uh, how you know that how the fam uh, Jordan Hill family was saying about the Holocaust and mm -hmm. you know, Jews mm -hmm. and stuff. Yeah, it, and it, they basically tell them like, boy, how y'all living though? A lot of how y'all living now? A lot of people Jews. do compare. The Jewish struggle to the black struggle. It's, no it's, co it's, 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 it's a comparison. Now, let me not say it's no comparison. But it's for me. I don't think it's a comparison at all. I'm going to say it's a comparison because they struggle. But what I'm going to say after their struggle is no comparison. Because they, they the Indians was good. The, no, the Indians had it fucked up. They still probably got it fucked up. They got like, kind of closed in. They, but they got, they got like those casinos. They got reparations. Money. Yeah. Reparations. Yeah. I'm, hold on. Let me go. They, but the Jews. Them motherfuckers so rich, they own everything. They got reparations. The right Jews, now, to this day, the Jews still get reparations. Right the, now. At all the we, we didn't do it. For some reason, we're paying them. Yeah. We didn't do it. They just if now anything, talked about in California. We saved y'all. They just now talking about in California how they're planning on giving reparations to black, you know, black African, African Americans. Period. African Americans. It's and, and, they, and the family who they gave them the uh, land back to. You heard of that story? Yeah. Yeah. My but this is like, is it, I'm getting back to the Jews and the, yeah, uh, yeah, 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 get back to the Jews and the black. Y'all, after y'all had that fighting struggle, y'all got these reparations. It's prospered. 
Y'all prosper. They own everything. Y'all got networks, that position. Basketball league, they, they own everything. Y'all got all of these things. But what have we been we, not? We, and it's been how long that we knew y'all had these things. People like Kanye that's been in those, that high power, knew you had these things. Real shit. Forever, forever, forever. I, did, I didn't know. Forever. Oh, I didn't know. know. I didn't, that's what I'm saying, I was about to say. I didn't know. Until Kanye and Kyrie exposed it, mm -hmm. I didn't know Jewish people were what they were in high powers like that. Yes. I did not know it. Yes. It really exposed yes. that they really own See, I everything. Mean, I mean, new because I be like kind of wired on it. Yeah, I, yeah, kind of yeah. I never knew it. that shit. You look in into it, uh, the main people who was speaking out when Kyrie and Kanye had that thing going on, they run shit. Yeah, I forgot their names. Oh. It might have been. I forgot their names, but it was like too many people that were speaking Adam out. Adam Silver, the commissioner of the NBA, didn't know he was Jewish. I never knew that. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? You know, I, I didn't know this shit. The motherfuckers who owned most of the media, I didn't know they were Jewish. I knew the nigga from TMZ. The white dude that owned TMZ, I knew he was Jewish. You know what I'm saying? But outside of that, they can't, they got to come out the woodwork like, oh, Man. you offended us. They 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 hold, they they got everything. I ain't gonna lie. They they, got, they really do. And, and it's it's crazy that they always want to say about the Holocaust. When the Holocaust was something that lasted Far shorter, like I mean, it was way. Uh, uh, the time of the Holocaust was way shorter than slavery. I, 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 I want to say it was you know eleven that? years, but I, I, I would be sick. <laughs> look, 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 look. You can look it up, but I'm just saying, like that time. Yes, people died. Yes, people struggled. Yes, it was fucked up afterwards. But that time compared to slavery is no comparison. It has some similarities. The Holocaust lasted 12 years. The Holocaust lasted 12 years. There you go. We've been but now we even looking up. Without me, we still went through systematic slavery. Facts. Till till this day. Yeah, not to even what? like get out of the Till this day. Fuck you talking about. Till this day. We're still going through. What you talking about? I don't no, know no, 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 no. It, it was an old quote he used to say. To this day. You feel me? Uh, like, <laughs> till this day, we're still going through the same shit. Yeah. Some people might think. It got better, you know what I'm saying? The Black Lives Matter. Well, it was a hoax. It, 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 it was a hoax. Was shit. Kansas was bullshit. Was exposed that kind what, of yeah. What, 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 what that. is Black, Black Lives, Lives do matter, matter though? You know what I'm saying? It do, the, but the, the organization was a hoax. Was terrible. Don't get me wrong, but what they said, Black Lives Matter. The fact that mm -hmm. you have to say that today is crazy as hell. You know what I'm yeah, saying? I don't think about the, that. The fact that we built this country on free labor. Mm -hmm. So many people went into towns and killed, mass murdered black people. Nobody went to jail. Nobody yeah. did nothing. You know what I'm saying? Black Wall Street was tore down. They killed 300 black people in Black Wall Street off a lot. Saying a, saying a black man raped a white woman. And when the white man went to confront him, he ended up shooting the white man. They came in there. That kind of that, that kind of sound like the uh, Emmett Till situation. I don't think they did enough for me to. That's why I, I didn't watch the movie. Yeah, that, 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 that new movie, I, I didn't even want to watch it. You see, uh, you know what I'm saying? I, look, I, sometimes, speaking, sometimes in history, black people like no. let me down. Uh -huh. Like y'all really sold. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> speaking of history, though, bro, it's like when you said that. I really don't like when uh, people take that stance on the uh, historic movies. What you mean? The ones that we got a part in. I don't even, I ain't look up the Emmett Till movie, I don't know nothing about it. Yeah. Like you said, I ain't watched it. He was from Chicago. Yeah. You're right. I know, I know yeah, he was yeah, from yeah. Chicago. I'm saying yeah. the movie, I didn't look at, I didn't watch it. Because it's, yeah. it's a couple of them. Yeah, I know yeah, the story. Yeah. But my thing is, Emancipation came out mm -hmm. with Will Smith, right? Mm -hmm. You ain't see. That's out? <laughs> you ain't even know it was out. That's out? You ain't even know it was out, bro. I thought that's what he had to do to get back good with Hollywood and shit. I think he slapped Chris Rock. You ain't even know it was out, bro. <laughs> no nah, he had that in the works before, but you ain't even know it was out. The thing is, the uh, like they didn't have no type of like media for it. They didn't push it. They didn't. You know what I'm saying? It was all like emancipation uh, I mean, done. And then you got like people like I'm tired of these slave movies. It's like this is one of the first ones that has star actor as. Star actors as black people, mm -hmm. the directors are black people. Mm -hmm. It's the film and company, you know what I'm saying? All this, not the film and company, I, but no, the directors, the actors are all black people. This story is being told by black people. I get it. You should tune in. I, uh, I'm, on you should tune I'm, on, in. I'm on the other side of it, though. I'm on the What's other side, side of it. Because me, me personally, I feel like 
every couple years they make a slave move that they let y'all remind y'all, hey, let me let y'all know y'all. Let me let y'all know. And in any moment, to me, what they be saying is, Nick, we can put y'all back. Now, when you just said that, I'm thinking about it. It ain't Holocaust movies going on like that. You, 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 you don't see no Holocaust Damn. movies. Damn! Schindler's List, nigga. Don't, Schindler's List was the last Holocaust movie. It ain't see, no Holocaust you movies. You don't see no Holocaust movies every year. That keep reminding them of what they've been through, right? I guess but, I guess I didn't look at it like that, bro. When I when I thought about it, yeah, Harry, it Harry Harry came out. Movies. Not yeah. too long ago. Uh, you don't see how they was getting done. No, no, no. Not too long ago, uh, uh, 12 Years a Slave came out. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? Like, they keep reminding you, like, hey, let me let y'all know. You know what I'm saying? They won't tell us about the black inventors. The shit y'all stole from us. You know what I'm saying? They won't tell Make us about... Movies, huh? yeah. yeah. They won't tell us yeah. about the people who actually fought back and won against y'all. Yeah. They won't tell us about them people. You know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of motherfuckers actually succeeded in fighting y'all off. Y'all won't tell us about those people. You know what I'm saying? Y'all won't give us shit, like... The woman king, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> to try to, to to try to masculate our women, uh -huh. you know what I'm saying? Like we don't have these feminine, beautiful ass women. Y'all want to yeah. butch them up, you know what I'm saying? No, folks, yeah. we not. We see through this shit y'all doing, bro. This shit it's weird. The, it's the, uh, it's the, look though. I'm gonna say I mess. It's, it's a double thing though. Yeah. Right? Woman king, masculate our women, but what's woman king? I ain't gonna lie. I don't know what um, you talking about. Um, um, What's buddy name? Uh, uh, Antoine Walker mom. Play Antoine Walker mom. Uh, okay. uh, uh Viola Davis. Okay. Viola Davis plays the woman king. Bro. She, African warrior. You know what I'm saying? The women defend the village ass up? shit. Couple months back. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I ain't even hear about it. But it, it just masculated black women. Mm -hmm. Make them seem so tough, not feminine. You know what I'm saying? Whereas, and on the opposite side, every time you see a black a show or a TV a movie, the black guy has to play the gay role. So you will feminize the men mm -hmm. and masculate the women. Like that's they really trying to fuck our culture. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like that's weird, bro. Stop reversing. I like, I like that you said that though because that's an interest that's an interesting point, bro. bro that, that shit crazy, bro. I I, I think to myself, like I I've seen too many shows where it's one black guy in this whole motherfucking show. Mm -hmm. He a gay guy. That's crazy. Yeah. That's crazy as hell to me. You know what I'm saying? That's yeah. crazy. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That, that's, that's that's whole, say, that whole say. agenda with uh It's an agenda. That whole agenda with this movies have to have that gay role or think whatever about you call it. Think it. about it's, it. It's kinda we, we, we come up in the nineties. Yeah, when well, we good see times, these. good daddy. Uh, Fresh Prince, good daddy. Yeah. Family Matters, good daddy. Yeah, talk You shit. don't see none of that shit no more. They have took black men out of a positive role, loving his wife, mm -hmm. loving his family, loving yeah. his kids. They snatched that shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, you know what I'm saying? Now, you have to be P-Valley. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You have to be some type of feminine. Folks, I see Eternals. You know Paperboy from Atlanta? Yeah. He played in Eternals. Mm -hmm. He's the only black guy in Eternals. He has a husband. And a son, like you said, you said uh, the rap on uh, Atlanta. Paper boy, paper yeah. boy, all about that paper boy. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, he's gay in that movie, bro. Oh they, my they, god! They snatch it. And you on the Atlanta, he was the character that's like me. The tough guy. Yeah, like, and I'm not, I'm not saying that like it's anything against that. Mm. You know what I'm saying? But I'm saying because, because yeah, we. I got gay family members. Facts. I, I don't have same. no problem. Same. With nobody gay. With nobody. It's not that. It's I have a son. It's let him if he want to do what he want to do. Let him do that. But he probably won't. Why is it no but positive let him imaging that. in media outside yeah. of a LeBron James? Outside of a don't, don't bring you know what I'm saying? Uh, 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 that, we gonna get on that later. But outside of a, you know what I'm saying? Right? Like you gonna get him in a feeling. Patrick Mahomes. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You have to play a sport of some type of shit. Why don't I see a regular everyday guy going to work, coming back to his family and loving his wife and kids? You don't see yeah. it. They have snatched that out of media. You know what I'm saying? It, it's crazy right now, bro. And I have black sons that I'm raising to be black men. You know what I'm saying? It's, it, it's crazy. But I, I, I will have to be the pillar of that. You know what I'm saying? I will have to show yeah. them how to go. You know what I'm saying? They, I, I can't get a, 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 a car Uncle Phil, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, I can't, James Evans, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? I can't get that no more. It, it's over with. You know what I'm saying? Shit, even even Fred Sanford took care of his son. You never saw the wife. 
Yeah. The daddy took care of the son. Yeah. Sanford the son. Lamont yeah. was there with the daddy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You never see that no more. It's old. Yeah, man. They, they 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 keep trying to put us down. That was a, that was. Hey, I ain't think about that on uh, Sanford the son. That was a good black man show, like. Cause me, I go out sometime with my son by myself. Yeah. I just see the looks. And like he, and he working. And he working. Like you know what I'm saying? You got your son. Like it just be the look like hey, you know what I'm saying? Like, he, he got a junkie on I like that he, he got an honest living. Honest living. I'm taking care of my son. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's not, it's not, it's not. You don't see a show like Sanford and Son no more. No, you don't. You don't. Pops and son shit. You know what I'm saying? Like mm -hmm. they took that out of there. Cause that's powerful. You know, to the black community, that's powerful. They'll rather yeah. feminize our men. You know what I'm saying? Because we need the men. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We need the men. Show these boys how to go out here and become men. And you work for everything you want. That's, look, because me personally, bro, this is my first son, right? <clears throat> well, my first child, period. So it's just like seeing how his grandma, his mama, my mama, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. My grandma, anybody, my sisters, my nieces, anybody interact with him. Yeah. These are all women I'm naming. Yeah. It's so loving, so he don't have nothing like it's like his his granddad, my girl dad, and me spoke to him like, what's up, boy? Like, like kind of loud, and he cried. Yeah, yeah. That voice. It's like, what is this? It's it. a man. They not used to it. So I'm thinking about, I'm, it, it, it opened my eyes when I'm like, he so like, like, cause I, cause I kind of did it aggressive a little bit, just messing with him. Like, yeah, yeah. But it was like, it opened my eyes like, when well, you don't have a man in this household, he's going to be taken over by these women. Facts. Not taken over as is a bad thing, but they over loving him. So he Look thinks like. the world is gentle. He thinks everybody is supposed to do this. Mm -hmm. Why aren't you loving me when somebody aren't loving everything. him? He Why? needs a little roughness. Facts. Which is crazy, right? I'm so happy I'm with my son. Like, son, when you watch this, I love you, right? So 70% of inmates are a product of a single parent household. What they don't tell you is that single fathers produce similar statistics of those of homes with two parents, while single mothers don't. So the key to keep your children out of prison is the father, but mothers are awarded custody 90% of the time, women are incentivized to leave a marriage, and prisons profit $74 billion a year. Am I thinking too much or is there some sort of plan here? Crazy, crazy. These are just some random fact statistics, right? Mm -hmm. Single father households give children the same benefit of a mother father household, mm -hmm. right? Single mother households actually, pro yeah. actually produce 80% yeah. of men that's in jail come mm -hmm. from single mother households, yeah. right? On top of that, single mother households on yearly produce like 1.6 million cases of child abuse. Fathers? What is the study at? Single fathers? What is the study at? I'm going to pull it up for you. Uh, you got to send sing, them, sing, let them see. Single fathers mm -hmm. actually have 600,000. So that's a million difference. Right? So you saying single fathers doing better than parents? Single fathers? This, it's all a scheme, folks. Okay. The courts, what they do? Get kids to the moms. Mm -hmm. Single moms? Most of, not all of them, because I'm not going to say that. I'm a product of a single mother my damn self. I take care of my kids. I go to work every day. I'm not out here doing none of that shit. I'm a productive member of society. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, if 80% of men that are in jail come from single parent, mm -hmm. single mother households, majority of rapers come from single mother households. A lot of shit happens on mom's watch. Damn. Wait, you you go have a lot of people mad at us, man. Controversy real. Hold on. Controversy real. Hold on. Hold on. Controversy real. real. Slow down, man. Slow down, man. <laughs> Slow down, man. Don DeMarco. Fuck you talking about? <laughs> hey, hey, hey. You, wait, repeat a, that. A repeat lot of repeat shit. that, bro. Look, a lot of shit happens on mom's watch. Mm. Damn. Actually, they say single father households. Children that come out of single father households mm -hmm. have the same advantages and are productive as if they came out of a two parent household. Single fathers produce better kids than single mothers. But guess what the courts do? What? Give them to the mamas. Mm -hmm. Cause guess what? We don't really want y'all to be shit. <laughs> you feel me? We don't really want y'all to be shit. We don't give you to the mamas. Fuck the daddies. 
What you know how you say when you say they don't really want to be shit, you talking about the courts. You ain't the, talking about the, the court. No, 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 no. Yeah, the courts. Yeah, the, courts. the courts. The courts don't really want yeah. to be shit. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Y'all know the statistics. Mm -hmm. Y'all know all these men that are in jail coming from single mother households. Yeah. Why not reward these kids to the fathers? Well, you know fathers are actually not better kids. Not, not reward. I'm gonna say that game. Look, look, rant. look, look. Rant. No, look, no, no. <laughs> Give. <laughs> no, look. <laughs> Man. I'm not saying that. Look, ladies, I'm with y'all. I'm with y'all. <laughs> not, not with y'all, but I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say, gang, look. I'm gonna say, not grant them or give them that uh, custody, but make it fair. Hold on, hold on. Make it fair. Make it fair. Whereas, as in, as in child support, make it whereas if that man shows you that he love, he's loving that child, that child, he's taking care of that child. He's buying him stuff. That child don't need for nothing. You know what I'm saying? The situation is there. Don't make him pay child support. Or, or don't make him pay... One thing I know about being a police, they uh -huh. have a code of silence, folks. And if you go against that code of silence as an officer, not only do they shun you, anything can happen to you, folks. Now you need backup. Motherfuckers don't want to respond. Don't nobody hear their radio. You know what I'm saying? Oh, hell no. Folks snitching on us. Oh, we ain't fucking with him. You in a whole shootout. They not coming now. You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit can get bad, folks. I'm not fuck with that. At the end of the day, like, when these people out here protesting, they sending the police out there on y'all. I, I, I protested. You know what I'm saying? Me, me and Lee, we went out there actually protesting. I, pro I protested at uh, South Lake. You know what I'm saying? We, South we, Lake we was right there in Hammond, folks. Yeah. We right there face to face with the officers. They Mason motherfuckers. You got black officers. You ain't, see my, you ain't see my video right from Paul Buck. No, no, I didn't. I had posted some video. That was a slight video of what was going on out there. We yeah. had a mayor in the video. A couple, uh, what is it, Alderman's and... Yeah, yeah, talk to them face to face. My thing is like, folks, yeah, I'm not gonna stand against my people when I know y'all wrong, folks. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, I'm a black man before I'm a police officer. Yeah. I'm a black father before I'm any of that shit. And these people be out here like, I'm just doing my job. Some shit supersedes your job, folks. You know what I'm saying? That cop out is lame as hell. At this day and age, folks. They done too much to us so you be on their side, folks. I understand trying to be the change. And in, in small instances, you can be that. Not to this lady cop. You know she got to get to work. You know she got to feed her yeah. kids. You know what I'm saying? Little shit like that you can do, folks. You know what I'm saying? But to sit back and for all y'all to be black and beat that man down like that, you crazy as hell. Y'all some sellout ass niggas, folks. That's crazy. Watching that video, you saying? Yeah. That's crazy as hell, folks. I could never, me personally, I could never do I wouldn't even let nobody do that shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. At the end you of the day. You saying if you was an officer. If I was an officer. Yeah. Realistically, you in a situation where you an officer, you spray a motherfucker in their eyes with mace. Mm -hmm. Your natural reaction is to rub your eyes. Yeah. But you telling me to give me your hands. How the fuck am I going to give you my hands if my natural reaction be, is to go to my thing, eyes? That be the thing when we get pulled over or when somebody get pulled over, they want to like be in control of the situation yeah. so much yeah. that it gets... Out of their control. Yeah, for and me personally, I, I I did do armed security, you know what I'm saying? I realized when you genuinely fuck with people, yeah. you get way more respect than trying to be an authority. An uh, over tough guy. You know what I'm saying? Over tough guy. Over tough, yeah. Over -tough talking guy. crazy and doing all that for you get way more respect. Okay. We just getting into it, y'all. Yeah, 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 they said, it, they said don't got a light. This this nigga ain't got no light in here, y'all. I don't smoke. He don't like no candles. <laughs> he don't like nothing. Fuck, I look I'm in here. I'm in the store. Now I'm trying to keep it. <laughs> this ain't quiet store, folks. Man, no lights out. Candles lit, folks. Fuck all that. Yeah, how's everybody's in y'all crib, man? LEDs. Fuck you people come here. Got bad experience with smoking fire, man. I don't, I don't do none of that. So let the people know how you that. <laughs> let the people know about that bad experience, man. Hey man, they came home drunk from the bar, folks, tried to cook some pizza rolls, bro. Cut the grease on and fell asleep for a whole motherfucker went up. Bro. I don't know what was going on out this bitch. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Look at those. I came to this crib today. Came to the back. I ain't never come to the back though. I ain't got a new crib. <laughs> Flow redid, everything redid, and this one even got new appliances. More of the story, you wanna you wanna refurnish crib, <laughs> set some shit on fire. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, you got a brand new crib in this one. Hell no. Bet I won't cook that shit no more, folks.
DoorDash. Let's talk about that, man. Niggas can't fry fries, man. You know, Burke the House down fry fries, gang. Hey, I Can you cook? Hey, I, I only fry shit, folks. I, ain't, I need an air fryer. <laughs> Fuck you talking about? It ain't my passion, folks. I can fry some fries, folks. Okay. But it's the liquor. The liquor got me. I ain't gonna lie to you. The liquor that night? The, so, the liquor fucked me up. What night was that? Um, that's actually was motherfucking uh, Father's Day. You feel me? It was you on. You know, damn near burnt the house down on Father's Day. Ah, uh, kids almost lost a father on Father's Day. <laughs> Shit was really crazy, folks. <laughs> like, this is a two story, y'all. I was like, I come in this yeah, motherfucker. I'm like, bro. Yeah, like, well, I thought I'm he moved because I ain't, I ain't been like about a, about a year. Kids I ain't were been home. Like about a year. No kids were harmed in, um, in this incident. Okay, no, nobody was hit but you. Yeah, but me, folks. And, 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 and look, though. I grabbed the fire extinguisher. I ran out. Grabbed a fire extinguisher, came back, put that bitch out. Folks. Fire, firefighters told me I was a hero. Real the hero. Real nigga activities. Real the motherfucking hero, man. They said fight or flight. I said fuck on fight. Fight or flight. Thinking of fight or flight, man. Uh, I said his name wrong. Who? TJ. That's his name. Oh, little TJ. Little TJ. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. little TJ back in the news, man. Lil TJ, uh, for the second time in two weeks, done got caught with a gun. Bro, they shot that man hella times. Man, if I'm him, I'm getting caught four, five, six, seven, eight times. Bro, with what that they say, folks? I'd rather be what? Judged by twelve than carried by six. I'm not. I'm not playing that shit, folks. I'm keeping the whole The way I mean, the way he living, the way they living out there, he need to move out of New York, honestly, oh, because the laws, the gun laws in New York. That shit ridiculous. They got no, they don't even, I don't even think they got a, a motherfucking like how is you, you see how It's the right to bear arms. You got the right to bear arms. I don't get why. They fucking up those people with yeah. mimics, folks. Like, that shit crazy, folks. That boy been shot, and he frail as hell now. You see him, folks? He looks sick. Yeah. They put holes yeah. in that motherfucking boy, folks. That shit over with, folks. Now, I, I, I get caught with that part too, but I ain't gonna lie. You got the money to pay the lawyers. Hey, what you gonna do, folks? They will keep giving his ass a uh, misdemeanor case. They, I, I, I heard it was an illegal search though, so he might even get off. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. You he see, Lil Zay got off up there. Who? Lil Zay. Zay Osama. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah Lil Zay Zay just get booked to Chicago on some other shit. Shout out to Zay, folks. Shout out to Zay. Man. Just stay out of trouble, man. Shit, bro. That shit crazy. Folk. He gotta stay out of trouble. Man. Gotta stay out of trouble. How the fuck you get signed in the same week you get you get booked in Chicago, get caught with guns? Folks like he had one of them guns. It's such a macho bitch, folks. What the fuck was that? You seen no pictures, boy? Yeah. <laughs> Four had random hash browns on that motherfucker. Four, what is going on with this nigga, bro? Yeah, that shit was crazy, bro. His ass was tweaking. He said random hash browns random on that bitch. Random hash browns on that bitch. The know. gun, that whole gun box was dirty. I'm like, that nigga exploded in there. had to spring out everything. Yeah, it exploded in there. Damn, before you tweaking. Hey, yeah, that shit off this motherfucker. What's that, Don? Yeah, we off the gun, man. Yeah, that's off the and it's the light shit. I get the dark gun. This nigga get the light gun, but that shit'll do it for me. Yeah. Fuck. So <clears throat> you got kids, gang? Definitely do. How many kids you got? A gang go. A gang go. Fuck. <laughs> I like that. I got. I got. I can start my own basketball team. What's up? <laughs> you got to start five. Oh, I got. I got that. <laughs> you got to start five. That. He said, "Gang, gang so, up." So, so you probably in the minivan. You slide in the minivan, then, right? Nah, now. I ain't in no motherfucking minivan, though. Okay. I was, I was, hey, if I get up, <laughs> I feel like a family car can be the minivan, but that's why I gonna be my girl car. I'ma have my own shit. You got me fucked up. I can't do all that shit for you. Know what I'm saying? The kids got another the daddy. Got that? The kids. Hey, 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 I can take a couple, y'all. <laughs> but I can't take all. Oh, come, come on, man. man. <laughs> Yo, my come come on, man. man. <laughs> I can come take on, a man. couple, y'all, fo. I can't take all, y'all, fo. Go on over there. Put your that mama. Shit, that, shit, <laughs> that shit dead as hell. Go over there, I got it. I'm going. I can't afford y'all in this motherfucker, fo. With my soul, I'll be bunched up though, fo. That shit dead, fo. I got kids, fo. Okay. Yeah. But like I was saying, it just needs to be fair with the parents, man. I feel like honestly, the laws have not updated to to motherfucking um fuck with the men side. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like the laws have not updated at all. Women right. have yeah. women have a lot of power. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Especially when it comes to the kids and all that shit. Like all she really gotta do is really be mad. I'm gonna get to that. So a lot of, uh, it's huge. A lot of women have custody, but here's the problem with that. 
here's the problem with that. I'm going to show you the problems with black women having custody. Um, so we already know what happens to these kids that um, that end up being raised by their black mothers. You can go here and there's a whole bunch of statistical statistical is it, disadvantages. Is it, this is just, it's, I'm sorry, real quick. Yes, this you're is bringing, like, You're bringing up statistics of yeah. children who are raised by their black mother solely. <clears throat> And I'm uh, yes, I have statistics well, for I black women about... raised by their father solely. Yes, I have that as well. Okay. So here's here's the stats. By who? And who, who is it by again? I'm sorry. Who is so it? This who is, are these this is, Yes, this this that for child abuse is coming from child protection resource that online. Um, typically, I like to use dot orgs because they're more credible. But then you can also go within the articles and see right. where they derive their information from. Yeah, that, and that's important. Yes. That's actually super important. You would be surprised. Absolutely. So we have we we already know the stats for for black mothers single homes, and we look at these these single mother homes, right? And we look at the child abuse rates. Mothers have um, the number for um, mothers total alone, or with someone other than the fa father, is sitting right here at a million uh, six uh, over a million and a half cases for child abuse. We look at the fathers; it's damn near half of that. Then we go down here and we look at the mother, just the mother in the house, the amount of cases of child, child abuse that were reported, 70.6%. And then we go look at the amount of uh, homes where it's just the father, less than half of that, 29%. So the children are being abused far more often when the mother's home than they are in the father's home. Let me ask you this. I know I'm not, but uh, let me ask you this. Are you on child support? For my sons, my oldest sons, yeah. Okay. My oldest son, and, and to me, mm -hmm. she might have a different story, but to me, how it came about, I had another, yeah. I had another daughter, and to me, that was the like straw that brought the camel back. I was always there if she needed something. I can always. Her biggest thing was like, I couldn't get it exactly when she she had called me out the blue like they need this. Boom. That's not how life works. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be like, I get paid this day. I got you. You feel me? <laughs> that wasn't enough for her, folks. Like, yeah, she yeah. wasn't fucking with that. I needed what I call you, nigga. And then when she found that I was having a daughter, she say, Oh, you're going on child support. You know what I'm saying? Mind you, I get my kids all the time. My sons all the time. Summers, breaks, everything. I get my sons. My daughters, psh, I'm going to a damn daughter dance February 23rd. Look, I live for this shit. I live for it. I, 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 I done saw you at the uh, course. You know, bring you know, you come to hoop, you had your sons with you. I I I stay with my kids, bro. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Mother could never tell you I don't fuck with my kids. My sons just left the day before yesterday. Like I fuck with my kids mm -hmm. heavy. I'm always gonna be there. Cause to me as a black man, yeah. I take pride in this shit. Sure, my sons that I don't have no record, I'm not on no drugs, I anything I got, I worked for it. You know what I'm saying? Like, fuck that. You know how parents used to tell us, do better than me. They smoke a cigarette, they tell you don't smoke a cigarette. Be like, do better than me. Fuck yeah. that. I'ma show you by doing it. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't never saw this nigga smoke shit. N nothing. None of that. That's good. You know what I'm saying? So I ain't got to never Drink tell like a fish. fish. Yeah. Drink like a fish. Yeah, I work my five days. And I did <laughs> not get it on the week. Drink like a fish. You remember? Well, we do that though, as young men that work hard. But you get 21, you earn that. You going to yeah, so. Like, I, I, I'm going to show my sons by example. Not, don't do better than me and this and that. No, I'm going to show you. My daddy didn't do this. My daddy didn't do that. I never saw my daddy do that. You know yeah. what I'm saying? That's, that's what a black man should be to me. Of course, I'm not perfect. I'm not trying to tell everybody to be perfect. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, you got to have some morals and values. And a lot of these niggas ain't got it. Mm -hmm. A lot of these niggas ain't got no morals and values. Bro. That shit weak as hell. At all. What you, what, speaking of morals and values, bro, what you think about... The switches on guns. That shit kind of crazy. Is that, that shit crazy? the situation? Hey, it's really making right it now. unfair. Cause back in the day, for like, you had a gun, I had a gun. Whoever gets to that bitch first, you gotta hit some. Nigga, like <laughs> now, <laughs> aim that bitch and spray. That's not fair, nigga. What are you doing? What the fuck? Like, damn, nigga, you done sprayed your whole clip. I'm still trying to get my little shit off. What the fuck is you doing, boy? Like that shit. You better hey, hope you don't miss. I swear to God. It's a stupid. <laughs> you better hope you don't. I, I pray you don't miss. Oh, you, you, I mean, you do miss. I pray you do miss. Yeah. Then I can get, I can shoot my shit back. But damn, 
Now I can't even get a switch. This shit illegal as hell. <laughs> Where the fuck they at? I, I try to find them. <laughs> hey, um, Who hey, got them? Fuck hey, you. Hey, hey, slow up, up, slow up, man. Slow up. Look. I'm lying. <laughs> This is all props. What Dirk say, this is all props. This shit is not real. <laughs> this shit is not real. Fuck you talking about. Hey! <laughs> oh, bro, look. I'm just getting that though, folks, because it's like, everybody got switches. Every, folks, I seen the video. <laughs> it's like, they ain't got no switch. You feel like, damn, for I ain't, this bitch ain't really. These teenagers went to a school basketball game. I say, damn. You talking in the city. In the city, folks. I know you talking about everybody had that. Everybody. Day. What nigga? I said another video. Nigga I'm having a graduation cap. Nigga having a graduation cap. Like, yeah, boy, I just graduated eighth grade. Ugly as shit. Ugly as hell. Everybody pull out switches. I'm oh, damn. Where are y'all getting them bitches at? Y'all got them for the long? I heard they dropped shit off in the hood. I don't know. I don't even <laughs> hood no more. I didn't graduate the bud. I'm too old for the hood. Oh, bro. Hey, <laughs> that shit funny as hell. Folks say. <laughs> Hey, it's unfair though. It, it's really unfair. Cause look, cause look, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, you shoot, you shoot your little one bullet, they done shot like three or four bullets. Nah, folk, if they press that motherfucking trigger at least three seconds, they can empty the whole thirty. Damn, they can empty the thirty. Three seconds, huh? Three, three, four, three to five seconds, they can mm. empty a thirty. I don't know nothing about no switches or nothing. I'm just, I'm one I'm trigger pull for you, you, you go send that shit. You better. Yeah. Damn, folk. That's what, that's what we on? You hate me that bad? That <laughs> shit talk as hell. Yeah, I don't hate hey, that. I done heard some niggas like, hey, they done had they move on them. Yeah, yeah. They, yeah for I, I got my move, but I know phone them be out. Switch it. I ain't, I'm a little, I'm put, I don't feel right. How we get out of here? Yeah. Don't do it. If you got a regular gun, you live. You live to fight another day. Nigga, like, hey, get, get the fuck out of there. Nigga, like, that shit dead as hell. So you saying, you saying you ain't walking around with no switch? Nah, I, nah, nah, nah. I'm, I'm a legal ass nigga. That's, that's real mm -hmm. shit, though. You feel me? Like, I try not to put myself in no positions. Yeah, it's not real shit, but I look, though. Look, though. Tell them where you live at. Tell them where we at right now. For, I'm, in, I'm in good old Indiana. 